What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Lucky. We're back with another episode in the USF Dynasty. Week number seven, y'all. Still undefeated, ranked fifth in the nation. And we got Kentucky this week, who is four and two. So we're going to do a deep dive over recruiting and then get right to the game for y'all. Like always, the coach is picking us to win this game. And surprisingly so, as Kentucky has us beat across the board everywhere except for points per game and defensively. So you know we're going to have to have a defensive going if we want to win this game. But I know our defense is up to the task. We're only giving up 113 yards a game. As far as Kentucky's leaders go, their quarterback is nothing special. And then defensively, Gibson has 17 tackles. Other than that, nothing to write home home about Hayes does have four sacks so we'll look out for him but I think we should be good should come out of this week with a victory before I get into recruiting though I do want to spend this one coaching upgrade that we have and finish off the saving factor and then recruiting wise it's looking like a solid bet that we're going to get Kurt Moore the number one strong safety he does have his visits that we're going to schedule for next week it's going to be against Florida who's number four on his list but I think as long as we win the game we got him and with our last 150 points I'm gonna go ahead and just give him to John Ingram and then we have six people who are Ready to make their visit and all six of them are coming out florida week which is next week unless i can't bring them out so far it's looking like i'm able to get everybody to come in but with that out the way let's get to this game game time y'all and we are back you already know we always go tails doesn't fail except when we pick it we get in the ball first so let's go out here and score they want to give us the rock let's show them what we do with it come on dollison break that let's see if we can hit something off with this read option of course not, but we'll try and beat him over the top. And with Vince, we're going to have him just do a little curl for us, which we're going to hit up. Let's go. And they're supposed to have a 99 overall defense. Nah, even that won't stop us. Let's go, Brian. Five big yards. Weaver. We got a Weaver sighting. Let's see if somebody can't beat that man's deep. Oh, no. We got to be out. We have got to be out. Oh, we are gone. Let's go. Oh, and he fumbled it out of bounds, though. Let's see if we can get something here going with um Charlie. We won't. So we'll just run it for six. Third and six. Let's see if we can make something happen here. We cannot. I could have threw it away, but we're getting a field goal out of this anyway. If our kicker can make it. Somebody get him. And of course, Jordan Smith got hurt on that last play. But it was a minor injury, back spasms. He should be back soon. And we got the quarterback plus sack. Let's go. But it's looking like he is a mobile quarterback. So we're going to have to keep an eye out for that. But right now, it's third and medium. So let's focus on getting off the field. Oh, 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 I should have picked that. I read it though. Back now on offense. We got Dusty in as quarterback for right now. So we're going to try not to get too crazy. And just hold strong until we get back our starter, Jordan Smith. And of course, the lines are here. Oh boy, the lines are shaking. Got to pick up this first down. Got him. There we go. Brian, that's what I love to see, baby. Dusty with a nice pass, too. Not gonna lie. Feeling kind of confident in Dusty when he does take over the range for us. But right now, we got Jordan back. So let's get it. Brian with another big grab. Tell me you might have to start moving to the starting lineup. Now, can we just cap that off right here with this touchdown? Yes, we can. Holden Willis with another one. One quarter in the books, and we got a 9-0 lead. Keep going strong. Finish this game off. And get one step closer to Alabama. We can't give a pass plays like that, though. That has got to be shut down. All right, so we sat in the blitz at them. They want to play games? We'll show them who gets the last lap around here. Mmm. Yo, Bowman, that's the second week in a row you've gotten beat horribly off the line. Oh, boy. Bo Huffman with the touchdown. All right, we just got to answer them back. It is Kentucky, and they do have a pretty high overall, so we knew this wasn't going to be an easy game. Got him. Let's go. 
Get up off of me. Oh, you got to break that tackle. We'll take it, though. That's how you pick up a big third down. Let's see if we can get a big score before the end of the half. You need a big play? Go to Ryan. He's going to catch it. Oh, let's go. I told you, you need a big play. Go to Dow Ryan. Moss, literally Moss the guy. Off his back and everything. That was a wild catch. We're back at you with the second half. And I want to say we got this. After that touchdown just now by Ryan. Unless he keeps his feet. Nah, he won't. Oh, I told you he was putting that rock on the ground eventually. And Hope with the scoop and score. And Mac Harris with the big hit to jar it loose. Back on defense, of course. See what they're going to do in here. Oh, that kind of always gets us. Wow. Wow, that was a hell of a pass. Third and short, third and medium. We know he's gonna try and run. They might try and throw a screen pass at us, but we're ready for all of that. I lied, I lied. I definitely lied to y'all. We wasn't ready for none of that. Alrighty, so we just gave a touchdown last drive. So we have to answer back. Now with a pick. Ooh, Dollison, right place, right time. And truth be told, I should have went to Dollison first. He was the open man. Ah, uh, drop it in there. Charlie Christian finally with a touchdown. That's what we needed from him. He was way overdue for one. All right, guys. We gave up a touchdown last time we was out here. But y'all have to make it up. Y'all owe me one. Bowman, get your ish together. D-line, make some tackles. Get some pressure. Stop letting this quarterback run all over us. Stop letting this running back run all over us. We better than this. This is not us, guys. That's what I was looking for. See, sometimes you gotta give these guys a pep talk and they'll be right back on their feet. Third and long, no pep talk required here. Y'all know what time it is. Money down. Somebody make a play. I read it, but I wasn't there in time. But I made the tackle. Back on offense. Let's see if we can put these boys away. They definitely don't want it with us. Oh, that's not the button I hit. Oh, oh, get up off my boy. Oh, you're having one of those games, Daryl. Okay, he should have scored the touchdown right there. He was a little bit faster, he might have. It's the fourth quarter, ladies and gentlemen. Throw your fours in the comment section. We're killing them right now. I know the backups will be in shortly, especially when they're doing stuff like that. This is probably gonna be the last drive that our starters play, so the backups will be in shortly. Unless they score, then I don't know. Probably still bring the backups. Oh, let's go. Vince with the touchdown. Yeah, that's going to do it, ladies and gentlemen. This game is over. We got the backups in. I'm going to see y'all at stat time. We're going to go right to the stats. Nah, that was a fun game. We came away with the big time victory. The most points I think that we've ever scored in a game, 47. And Jordan Smith went on a tear. 16 for 19. Damn near 400 yards and four touchdowns with zero interceptions. Rushing wise, Batty only had 29 yards. He stepped to that more. I mean, we were up big. I should have ran it. It is what it is. Batty did get a touchdown. And then Holden Willis led us in receptions with six. Darryl, Darryl Ryan had 190 yards in the game. And he's only a sophomore. Remember that. And Vince Smith had a decent game. And we finally got a big play from Charlie Christian. One for 40 and a touchdown. I was starting to wonder where you went, kid. Offensive line, trash. And then defensively, Daquan Evans actually led us in tackles this week. Tack-wise, Garrett Pope had two. Eric Bates had one. And Eugene Bowman had a sack. Wow, I didn't I don't even remember that one. And Shaper had a sack. We had no interceptions this week, but Garrett Pope was able to get fumble recovery for 25 yards and a touchdown. Other than that, y'all, 
Y'all see the score down below. We gave him a shellacking, and we're going to keep it on moving. Still undefeated. That's all I can say. Till the next time we speak, y'all, video up above. Playlist is also up above. And down below, you know, the subscribe button that y'all should be smashing right about now. Other than that, peace. Peace.